because engaging is just speaking to someone, talking to them, being in connection, relationship with them. When you engage something, you actively participate in it. So you seeing, feeling is engagement. It is in engaging God is it having a relationship with him in which you can talk to him and listen to him and feel and sense and have experience. So I don't think you're clueless in it, really. I think you're probably trying to overthink what the word is when you're actually already doing it. Um, so that means that I experience God in different places, in different things, doing different things. And there are different types of engagement. There are different types of experience. Sometimes it's just hanging out and enjoying the presence of God and just being with him and just being there. Sometimes we go and do things and he shows me things. Sometimes, you know, he asked me to do something for him and then I'll go and do that on his behalf. That's all part of um, different ways of experiencing God, of engaging him in different places. Sometimes I would engage him on the throne of grace, particularly if I've got some issues I want to talk to him about. So I would go to the throne of grace and sit on his lap and hand all my things over to him for grace and mercy. You know, I sometimes go to his throne and I fall on my face. That's a different type of engagement in the experience is different because the situation is different. So there are different types of experiences with God, depending on what, what you're looking for, where you are and what God wants. Most of the time, I just want to be in his presence and be heart to heart and know his heart and so my can be guided and directed by his heart um so i think you know to be honest it's like i think you probably are overthinking what the word means and you're already doing it but there will be lots of different experiences that you have which will expand on those things you know um relationship is the key but in sonship there are things that are part of our destiny that we get to do and at work that um, in relationship with God. So I think, you know, just enjoy, enjoy your relationship with God, enjoy seeing and feeling and experiencing and let him set the agenda. Let him lead the time you spend with him. And then if there is something specific that you want to do, then you can go and do that with him, particularly if you want to go and talk to him about something specific or you can engage him in the garden of your heart. You can meet with him. Essentially, engaging with him is just meeting with him in a particular situation or circumstance. You can meet with him in the garden of your heart. You can meet with him in your gate of first love. You can meet with him on his throne. You can meet with him in different places in the realms of heaven. You can meet with him in any place that he wants you to meet with him. So just enjoy the relationship and you'll find that all these things will just begin to expand and increase if you enjoy these videos would you please take a moment to like comment and subscribe it really does help thank you very much